Hello viewers, welcome to Quick Mathematics. The problem is solve for s in the equation exponential 5s minus 14 exponential 3s equal to minus 24 exponential s. In attempting to solve problems like this, sometimes we may have linear equation, quadratic equation, or other forms of equations. Let us take the quick solution. Before then, if you are new to this channel, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell so that you will be the first to be notified whenever there is an amazing video such as this from me. Solution. If you observe the given equation very well, you will see that exponential s is common. To continue, divide through by exponential s to give us a headway to know where to continue from after dividing through by exponential s you have this result we can get exponential 2s from the first term if you factor out power of 2 from power of 4s you have it in this form to so continue we cannot solve for s directly but we can let exponential 2s equal to another variable let's say equal to variable y if you put y here it becomes y square minus 14 y in order to solve the resulting quadratic equation, you have to transfer this term to the left hand side. It becomes minus 24 equal to zero. Solve by using factorization method. If you compare this equation with the general quadratic equation, A is the coefficient of the term that is squared that means a is equal to one b is the coefficient of the middle term that is minus 14 c is the constant term that is 24. since a is equal to one to factorize find two factors of the constant term 24 whose sum is the coefficient of the middle term minus 14. Such factors are minus 2 minus 12. To continue, you express the factors in terms of the variable y and replace the middle term with them in this form. The purpose is to have four terms so that you group them in twos in this form. From the first group, y is common. If you factor out y, you have this result. From this group, minus 12 is common. You factor it out you have this result at this point y minus 2 is common again when you take it out from this term you have y remaining from here you have minus 12 which we combine to form the other term and you equate the product to zero from here, you equate each term to zero to have two linear equations. If you solve them 
respectively, y is equal to 2 or y is equal to 12. But we are to solve for s. You come back here and note that exponential 2s is equal to y. When y is equal to 2, you have exponential 2s is equal to 2. In order to solve equations like this, you take natural log, that is, lean in your calculator or log to base E of both sides. You have it in this form. By power law of log leading, this 2s we go back and multiply the log in this form equal to log 2 base e. When the number and the base are the same, the result is 1. So log e base e is 1 times 2s. You have 2s equal to log 2 base e. To get s, divide both sides by 2. In your calculator, you have lean to replace log base e. So both expressions are the same. If you check lean 2, you have 0 0.6931 divide by 2. You have s to be equal to 0 0.3465. Five. You go again by solving for S when Y is equal to 12. When Y is equal to 12, you have exponential 2S equal to 12. Take natural log of both sides. You have it in this form. By power law, you use 2s to multiply the log from behind in this form. Log e to base e is 1. So we have 2s equal to log 12 base e. To get s, divide both sides by 2. So you have log 12 base e over 2 to be the same as lean 12 over 2 and you have 2.4849 divide by 2 and that is 1.24245 therefore s is equal to 0 0.34655 or 1.2425. Two,